Hey guys, Bill Jordan here. I'm at 201-790-3368. If you're a painter, a sculptor, or a candlestick maker, this is the place to be, all right? People know you by the story you tell. The best way they can know you is my candid video, video interview. That's, that's the bottom line. It resonates with them on the soul level. And you as an artist, you have a special function, a special job. You have to like, your job is to come here, right? Maybe your path is not already determined by someone else. You have to make a path and follow that path, right? Make your own path. But the bottom line is you want to make the planet better for having been here. That's what your art has to speak to. It's not just art for art's sake. It's okay to make, you know, a nice bowl of fruit, but I have a, a higher purpose while you're making the bowl of fruit. There are cosmic bowls of fruit. Do you understand my run on that? You know, like, I, I, maybe I'm wrong, but I just sense that we're just so into this thing. We're not, you know, we're not free to be, if I call you up and you tell me no, that means you're not free to me. Because if you call me up and I'm gonna say, okay, what's up, man? Let's talk. I, we're so restricted. We say we're creative people, but we're not. How can you be a creative person and you don't give me a chance? By that I mean is this, not just if I call you, you listen to me, but, you, you know, you hear me, but listen to me. You know, not just hear me, but listen to me. Because many times what we have is that we have these conversations, and I spoke about it before. When we're dialoguing with someone, the other guy is like, you know, he's ranting and raving about his position. And our, and our view is like, my position is so important that I'm going to either cut into him, or as soon as he finishes, I'm going to say, well, blah, 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 blah which means that it gives him no satisfaction of having been understood. You know what I'm saying, man? I mean, and that's some, isn't that similar with our work? Because as within, so without. You cannot be more than you are on the inside. Your work cannot be more than you are on the inside. To go to be the, a great artist, you have to be able to transfer information from the invisible to the visible. And that's what the Candid Video Interview does. It helps you do that. See, like, you know, it's so certain for me to work with you, not only financially, but because you help me with my purpose. My purpose is to raise the consciousness of the planet. I get excited when I see artists who, who do that. And, and it seems by and large, you know, there's that something to do with age maybe or a particular cultural expression that, that has, is more in line because the basic American thing is flat, it's bland. You know, no respect to the British food, but basic British food used to be bland. Before the, the Indians came over there, man, you get you some, you get some hot food now, but before it was just like bland British food. It was bland. You know, no spice, no energy. It's like, it's some, none of your work is the same. Maybe you got good technique, but it's, I mean, I'm speaking to these guys that do the plain air stuff. You guys are great, some of you are great. Those guys are good. They tell good stories. But there's a whole bunch of you out there that should not be doing that. You do it as a hobby. And you put it on, on, on the freaking, you know, uh, robot uh, gallery to sell your stuff that you know is not really good. You just did it, you know. And when I call you to, ask, to tell your story about it, you don't respond because, you know, you know it's not good and, you know, you don't want to be considered to be a faker. But here's the deal, guys. There's so much goodness out here, so much good stuff to be done, and I can help you. I just don't understand why, I mean, I know why some of you don't call. Some of you don't know me, don't know about me. I'm a safe guy, I'm not gonna hurt you. You know, we have concerns about me crawling through the phone to get you. I mean, I'm not asking for anything other than Maybe in a one hour of your precious time, out of your precious day, out of your precious life, to help you move forward as an artist. Not only to help you currently, but to leave a, a documentation of your process, of your work, for your, for your progeny, for your family, if that's important to you. Some people think that's extremely important. So I can help you with that too, right? And quite honestly, I think it is important because we always have photographs of relatives, you know. There's Grant, Aunt Susie, and there's Beulah, and, you know, all those people that you know and love, you see their photographs, and they look, you know, 
you know what I mean? <laughs> Especially the real old ones, you know, the sepia type ones, you know, it looks like almost like gangsters type stuff, you know, and you say, wow, they were weird. Look at how they used to dress, right? You know, and the same thing is going to happen when people look at your photographs. It's like you just took it, look at the yearbooks, you know, you say, wow, look at those guys, man, they got to this and that. And it's always changing, but it's the same thing, the same people, just different clothes. <laughs> But be an artist, call me up, 201-790-3368, all right? I do candid video interviews. If you're a painter or a sculptor, this is the place you need to be. People buy from people they know. The best way for them to know you is with my candid video interview. All right, peace out.